So for the next questions in Chem Activity 2, uh, all of these questions here is uh, referring to what you can see in the periodic table. Um, so it tells you, it will ask you a lot about the uh, average mass in AMU and also how uh, things compare to 6.022 times 10 in 23rd, and that is one mole. And so um, these questions here uh, is testing you on how you understand, well, how well you can read the periodic table. And if we look at magnesium, you're going to find here that uh, the atomic mass is 24.31. And of course, one magnesium atom is not going to weigh 24.3. It's uh, different isotopes of magnesium, and all of them together will have an average mass of 24.31. And so that's the average atomic mass for one magnesium. It is also really great to remember that a mole is made specifically so it fits so perfectly with this atomic mass because it is the same thing as saying if I have one mole of magnesium, it will weigh 24.31 grams. And this is made specifically, so it's going to be easy for you guys to um, read the periodic table. And hence, uh, this difficult number, one mole, which is 6.022 times 10 in the 23rd. Um, then there's a little bit more about the mole so you, uh, so you still can understand the mole. It, it just tries to explain one dozen is 12 and mole, one mole is uh, this big. Like 12, you have uh, one dozen, you have 12 items. And if you have one mole, then you have this many items. And so it starts a little bit easy if I have a dozen elephants and uh, what is uh, the more amount of animals, a dozen elephant or a dozen chickens? Well, it is the same amount. The size of the animal doesn't matter because it's a, I was asking which has more animals. A dozen is a dozen, it's 12. And so that's how these uh, questions you need to answer them the same way. Which have more atoms, a dozen hydrogen or a dozen argon? Well, there's still 12, so they're both the same. Um, and then it also is trying, you, it, they want to push a little bit here without using a calculator. So Try if you can uh, figure this out, which weighs more uh, so-and-so many sodium atoms or one mole of sodium atoms. Well, one mole, if we uh, look here, one mole is 6.022 times 10 in the 23rd and 6.0 is more than 5.1. So just use your um, common sense here. And so one mole should weigh more because we are looking at the number of sodium atoms compared to another number of sodium atoms.